We are going to add the Quizlet app to our Canvas course, and you can see how easy it is to add to your course and use from inside your course. So the first thing you're going to do from your home page is scroll down to your settings on the bottom left. This is the back page for all instructors. And from here on the top, you can scroll over to apps because you're going to be adding a Quizlet app. And over here, it says filter by name. So if you start typing Quizlet, you can see there's many, many different apps here you can choose from. Some of these are free, some of them are not. Quizlet is absolutely free. It pops up here, and it's a little um, uh, explanation of what it is. So click on that, and then you can click on Add App. You can rename it something else if you like, like you can name it your course name, quizzes, or course name, flashcards, or something like that. And then you can click on Add App. Now it's in your course. So if you go over to for example, one of your assignments, week one assignment. Uh, I'm going to open that up. And you can see, if I click on the edit button, the queue here is Quizlet. So that's been added to your selection across the top toolbar. So if you click on that queue, you can embed content from Quizlet quite easily. So you can search for terms. For example, um, A&P is a common thing for Model Core and Allied Health. Um, and you can find a lot of different things that are already in Quizlet to select from. And you um, can also make your own, if you go to Quizlet, you can make your own files there as well and make your own flashcards. So I'm just going to do a and Muscles randomly here, take a look at it. Before you embed it, you can go through it and see if this is what you want. This one's got photos on it. Um, and you can go to different things and, and check and see if this is what you really want and make sure these terms are what you need and what you want. Note also that there's an embed uh, uh, link right up here. So just click on that if this is the one you want and embed it in your course. And then go down to the very bottom of the course page and don't forget to do this important step. Click Save. So now this is embedded in your course and your students can interact with it and you can interact with it and you can create uh, quizzes to go with it or whatever you want. Up on the top here it also has options and this is also what the students can click on. They can have a different a flow set of flipping or uh, they can turn your audio on or off and you can use lots of different things that way. So Quizlet is very handy for different types of quizzes and ways to um, study. There's a study guide here, they can scatter, they can learn, they can test, use flashcards, and they can even do a space race uh, within Quizlet. So that's how it looks inside of an assignment. You can also add it to a discussion. So I'm going to click on my week one discussion. And since it's been added to my course, when I click on edit, that cue is right there for me to use. And it's also in my quizzes as well. So it's interactive, um, can be uh, put in lots of different places in your course and be uh, designed the way you want to. So remember, settings, apps, and add. That's how you do it.